For most youth, becoming a refugee signals a crisis of hopelessness. Take Ismail. At 26 years of age, he is educated but cannot find a job. His sister Jose has been forced to drop out of school. In exile, the family is experiencing extreme poverty. Ismail and Jose's mother is sick. She needs urgent medical attention, but her children do not have the means to pay for it. What am I supposed to do now? Ismail's qualifications are no use. His efforts to find a job have been fruitless. Occasionally, he finds casual work. But the little money he earns is insufficient to meet the family's needs. Ismail's sister is also facing serious hardship. Without the protective structures of family and community, she resorts to engaging in commercial sex. You are having a business on you. What business I have? <laughs> what? Your body? How can I use my body? I can't eat myself. Let's go, let's go, let's go. I'm going to, huh? I'm going to show you how you can use your body, okay? Okay. You first come. We go together. Very handsome guy. Oh. Really, see, my love. Look at me. What the hell is this? Look at this beauty. So beautiful. Just look at me. Look at this. Oh, so how much? How much? How much? Just more money. How much money? Baby boy. Just a 50k. 50k? 50K? Yes. Really? Of course. I don't know much. Okay, 50k. Okay. Okay, can we go? Yeah, okay. Are you ready? Yes. Bye. What is my future now? As young ready, huh? Me, me, I don't know. Oh, who can help me? nothing. I struggle in different ways. I passed here, I passed here, I sell my body, I work in crab, I work in the house. No, I didn't get anything. <laughs> 